Hello everyone and welcome back to Ultra's Plays Dead Cells. I was really excited to play because we all have been given this brand new uh, and free Rise of the Giant DLC, which it does give us some uh, options, including, I thought I might do this because why not? Uh, where is this? Apparently you can now change, ooh, allow you as many between each run, allow you to activate and disable mods. Interesting. So we have mods now. Uh, there, you can also change various things like... We've always been able to do that. I don't know. Somewhere you can change aesthetics about your character, but I'm not going to bother with that now. Just wanted to see if anything more interesting has changed in between now and then. Let's have a look. I'm not going to do anything silly like, oh heck, something has changed. Where the hell has Old Bones gone? Chopping block. It's like I had a bad time with it. Oh, let me see. So we have a... Uh, it's going to be a uh, free stuff, right? Yeah. yeah. Well, that's a bit noisy. Hope it's not too loud for you. It seems louder than anticipated for me. And this is a lot easier to find. Hmm. Interesting. I wonder if we can get into anything up there. I remember seeing a YouTube video which said how to get the secret blueprint hidden up here. Oh, by the way, there's new blueprints, which is great because I have got them all already. <laughs> Obviously, I need to do more stuff. Ay, ay, ay. Um. <laughs> What's in here? Hello? It says no. Uh, that could be the uh, optional super difficult place. I'm not going to do the daily today. Let's try Boomerang Greed Shield. Uh, why not? Let's see what's happening. <laughs> this seems horrible and terrible. And it seems, seems like he might have been in a bit of a rush. Sort of fire over there. Well, there he goes. I don't want to go in there, do I? Anything here? Always go the wrong way when you're playing a video game. That's what everybody knows. He's gone into the lava. Guess he didn't want to come back after all. Definitely not going in after him. Hmm. Oh, same question. Yeah. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, genuinely no idea. I'm guessing there's something you can... Un oh, yeah. I'm guessing there's something you could unlock. Hmm. Does he really have claws this size? Uh, I've used most of my <laughs> taking damage already. Good start. I'm kind of guessing that maybe I would have been able to find some uh, some uh, food to repair. Oh no! This is not what we want to see at all. This is making me sad. Let me out. Can't kill anything. This is silly. I can't say anything. There's nothing I can say. Right now, just leave me alone. There's a lot of money, though, from all these... Uh... Oh, I used my shield by accident, and I couldn't use it again. Nice-ish. I'm not going to use my... Um... Oh, well. The other item is bleed, and drop a healing item. What is that? Excuse me? I don't know what these enemies are, and I don't know how to deal with them. Okay. I, I do not appreciate being given a... Uh... You, you fell off. That doesn't happen. What's happening? Why? There we go. This is bad. I don't recognize this enemy and they're all invisible. It's horrible. There we go. There we go. I've only really got my... Um, my... <laughs> what is happening? I've only really got my shield as offense and defense right now, which means that if I've used it wrongly, then all is lost. Then fall Caesar. Scroll of power, sure. <laughs> it's gonna be survival because help me. Also, you only get one vampirism per level, I believe. New law. Specialist shop. Responding to the most eccentric of demands for over 15 years and at least eight updates now. <laughs> nice. Uh, I really appreciate the breaking of the fourth wall sort of shenanigans we get going on here. What is this? A map of some description. It's a lot of money, but we could get there. I appreciate this because. Having a lot of money from the previous run, especially if you keep upgrading that thing, uh, it's not that useful early game, so now it is. A whole bunch of plants that seem to have been a bit underwatered recently. It's like this guy loves flowers. wonder what sort of flowers these guys are. There's a label on the pot. Do not water after midnight. That thing planted there looks less like a flower than an experiment gone horribly wrong. It does somewhat look like uh, what you might call the littlest pet shop, little, little shop of horror sort of magic. There are seeds on the window ledge. 20,000 for that door up there. That must be where he got his supply from. Mattress. 
All the fabric from the bed seems to have been torn up and used elsewhere. Uh, maybe hanged prisoner. Guess he wanted to choose the time of his death. He's holding a faded flower between his fingers. A moment of silence. Nah, I've got better things to do. Alright, cool. Yeah, we do. Uh, sure, two extra jumps for me there. Yep, uh, and 20,000... Uh, there's no way I'm having 20,000 gold this early. Even if you give me a troll chest like that one. Which, by the way, not entirely sure I was in a position to uh, deal with. We have two k k k k kills <laughs> without taking damage. This may be a cursed run, and I apologise, but not very much. Um, at least until we can get something that isn't the boomerang. Which is very funny. Short, sure, white... Sure, uh, I don't... I like the previous boomerang that we had on that daily because the boomerang we had on that daily was usable. Uh, no, no. That would be good, but we can't afford it. But we do have the gold shield, so... Uh, yeah. It is potent form of... Uh, offense. So, keep it. Let's go. No more invisible enemies, please. We can distract the dudes and then bop them. Yes, very good. Nice. Okay, we, we may have something going on here. Possible that we can use our uh, powers of distraction, i.e. bitey things. With, um... With some effects. Yikes. Leave me alone. Oh, never mind. So, there's that. Oh, <laughs> he nearly got me. What's this? It's money. Ah, I want money! I mean, it might be good, but... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Couldn't roll because I was too busy attacking. I, I honestly just blanked this enemy having attacked me. Which is kind of how I died in the last run. Let's not talk about that. Crikey. I'm only playing this to see what's new, and... I'm not only playing it to see what's new. I'm also playing it because I like playing it. <laughs> I'm kind of playing it just to see what's changed. And uh, honestly, everything has changed and I'm dying. So, it makes me sad. 21 HP. I don't... <laughs> Is this the thing we want? <laughs> he says, buying it anyway. I spent all my... Actually, I haven't spent all of my money. I feel like I've still got more than I started with. And maybe because we got the fortune slash misfortune, depending on your perspective, to, um, to start off with a, a troll chest. There. Excuse me, I'm very much sure I parried those things. Also, why did you get um, to be shielded briefly at that point? That's not fun. I don't like that. Please give me something that is of major value and not just silly. No. <laughs> I just, I just, just give me that one single thing that could be any good for me, okay? There's like one weapon in the whole world, which is both... Um, Green and good. <laughs> I want it. Gimme, gimme, gimme. I've really come around on this shield idea, to be honest with you. I'm not doing very well with it today, but there's new things surprising me. We don't like surprise moves. Nice. Uh, what is going on here? Cannot be interrupted. That's nice. But, um, why does it keep pulling things towards me? Do I have something else? Item empty. No. There's nothing that I have that is causing the... Why are you doing this to me? There's nothing I have that causes enemies to be pulled towards me, nor that causes them to have the, um, the little weird grappling effect. Well, I'm guessing that's part of the same thing. The, um, yeah, I'm not... No. This is too difficult. <laughs> I'm not, not into it. Uh, the, there's the... It's doing the thing with a lock above it, and I think it's because I'm grappling them somehow, but there's nothing on here that says that. So what's happening? It's, am I not reading something? What? 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 Let's go to the promenade where we can possibly survive for more than two minutes. I'm hearing a hissing noise. Is my headphones okay? I think so. What, what has changed here? I didn't even manage that because everything was too hard. New. Hunter's mirror. Unlocks a mirror near the scribe that may come in handy during your hunt. Okay. I'm not going to be able to uh, 
just... I don't like it, any of this enough, so I'm not going to do it. Well, hello, Mr. Sir. Yes, um, please give me the one where I get HP after parrying a melee attack. Thank you. Uh, and I can't use that, so I might have to immediately just heal myself or just start another run, which is less cursed. Because uh, it says hard. It says I'm on hard mode, so just cut me some slack, right? I'm on hard mode. It says it right there. The game agrees with me. I'll open the store the old-fashioned way because I'm feeling polite. I wouldn't mind a little bit more money, so I went for that, even though normally I don't. Nice. I appreciate that only one of those needs to connect for that to be a thing. I, I, it's, it's happening still. What? Sure, I rolled, but okay. Heck, you too, I suppose. What? <laughs> it died. Give me this. There we go. These things are... This is not the promenade of the condemned. This is the graveyard. Why are we in the wrong place? Why have you done this to me? What is happening? You, be carried. You didn't hit me because I was not there. What? I think they may have a, a timeout so that when they're actually getting towards me here, we're... Um, I understand. I think I figured this out. I was not expecting these enemies to be here, so I'm not ready for them. I'm rolling, but nothing is happening. I am just pushing the button and my character's just standing there. I'm... Uh, run... To, let's start this again. Too much has changed. <laughs> what is happening? Load the start. It's not funny. Let me go. Leave me alone. Look, way more money than I started with before. A one boss cell. I almost can... Vince not to bother with that. Uh, thank you for the balance blade and... Okay. But I'm taking the balance blade. For now, I think starting with no melee damage is going to be a troll again. Yeah. It's okay. At least I've got attacks this time. I've got skills this time. Why am I critting? I don't understand. What have I done to deserve crits? Do I crit from? After 10 successive hits. Is that new? That might be new. Alright. Learning something else, which may be that the, uh, the actual, um, uh, you were dead. I saw it explode and I got, mo oh, I broke the thingy and I thought the money meant that I killed the broke. Stop shooting me with enemies I've never seen before just because I'm playing on a hard mode. I can only parry two of those, which is really annoying. Alright, I, I don't know this enemy, but I very much would not like to meet it ever again. What is happening? <laughs> this game has changed. You have become too difficult. So there's an enemy that throws th three things at me, of which I can parry two. <laughs> there's, and they are invisible, and um, also... Uh, they run away even more effectively than those archer thingies do. Why are you giving me these? Okay, rule number two. Do not open this friggin' chest. Where is it? Do not open this first chest. It says X break, and X is not breaking it. But... This is... Probably should be RB to break. Force door. Let prison manage to get out of prison early. See this one, right? Oh, oh. Small bag. Left his bag behind him. Must have been quite a panic. Shiny pebble. Why? Why? Don't open the first chest. It's cursed. Don't play the first run, it's cursed. Don't take the first item, they're cursed. Don't download the DLC, it's cursed. I can see you down there. Don't think that I don't. Also, uh, why is X? This is a problem. Right, okay. We can do this. We know how this works. We stop shooting before it goes red. Where it starts hurting us. Keep an eye out for invisible monsters, which is a strange thing to say, but you can just about see them when they're wobbling around. Uh, there's one down there, in fact. I would like grenades, because I can definitely kill these horrible monsters with flipping grenades. And then I don't have to worry about parrying them. Also, I could just, like, stun them. <laughs> I do have the deeps to uh, beat them. Just that they don't really want to admit it to themselves. Wait, no, don't go there. Oh, this guy got difficult. 
I'm wondering if, uh, oh, hi. Maybe the, uh, a part of the issue may be simply that, like, this enemy may be new, but if you had met it in normal mode, it would not have been in this floor, much like the, uh, well, they seem to have replaced the, the summons, right? Because I haven't seen any of those. I think they're called summoners, anyway. Is that what they're called? I don't know. Um, but, you know, the, the priesty things that can shoot through walls and make me mad every single time. I'm guessing they still exist, but they're not in this floor, which kind of makes me believe that the developers consider this one to be an easier enemy than the new one. Also, I've not seen vampirism this much ever. So what is happening? So smart here. Yeah, well, you ain't. Oh, look, I did it this time. All right, the curse is lifted. <laughs> well, imagine if we'd been playing an actual curse run where one hit is killed. One hit is dead. No, no jumping. Good. Good boy. Good job. Nice. All right, this is a, a, a weapon I can get behind, so don't worry about me. I think I'll be happy. But I'm glad that we've managed to get so far whilst talking about the game, because it means I don't have to talk about anything else. There is... um a kebab and I don't need it, so up yours, game. I am the winner, you are the loser. I am rubber, you are glue. Bounce off me and sticks to you. Do you ever... I was trying to think of... That was a different nursery rhyme from the one I was actually trying to think of. Uh, and now I'm stuck trying to figure out what... Ooh. I'm going to go yes, please, thank you. Because A is better because it's not the first weapon of the game, and B... Uh, I, I think it might be better because enemies are liking uh, being helpful and lining up recently. Um, although I'm half expecting to now come a complete cropper of these things that are horrible and I have never seen before. Um, I was I was yard booing at the game you know, because the game was being silly and getting it wrong. But I'm going to use this now. If it bleeds everything, which means I can basically speed it. Uh, but. A lot of the stuff that I encountered growing up, and this is, it's not just my generation, the generations have been, there's enough generations that have this phenomenon on that it's not just me, because it's basically uh, media. Ever since we had media and could transmit from other countries and therefore other cultures, we have had this problem, I guess. <laughs> I don't call it necessarily a problem, but uh, it's 2000, I'm going to buy it. Um, I don't care about this. It's pretty, it's, that vampirism is a lot better than it used to be, absolutely, but I don't, still don't care about it. Um, I'm going this way. I watched a lot of TV and played a lot of video games in which I didn't understand a lot of what was going on. And the reason, quite clearly I hope, is that it was American. Um, and Americans would have grown up with a different set of you know, nursery rhymes and taunts and things like that. I like all of these as a concept. But this is the only one that really does me any good. And also, I never use the crusher properly. So know thyself. I've got two grenade things now, which I do know how to use. So I'm going to do that. Uh, and we seem to be going the wrong way again, but that's okay. Uh, let's pump everything into... Let's do this. I really should start... Do you know what? Let's just do this. I'm sick of this. I don't think these two are going to be any good at some sort of random point. They would have been good in the previous one. Uh, actually, probably not. Oh, I don't know. Uh, let's do this one. I want this one unlocked and just sell all these. I'm wondering if a purple run would ever be any good for me, but I don't know. Maybe if we got good at the game, it wouldn't matter. We... So... Uh, I... I played a lot of games and watched a lot of TV that I just didn't understand what was happening. Which is a big deal. Because... I felt like it should be funny, I felt like it should be relatable, but it never was. Um, so, one of them was I Am Rubber, You Are Glue, which was a taunt, a sort of a response in Monkey Island, in the first Monkey Island, against a, a taunt slash insult. And I was like, okay, <laughs> what do these mean? Many of them were just like that. Um, I can't actually bring any to mind right now, but I was reminded of I Am Rubber, You Are Glue. So, and it was a long, long time between first hearing I am rubber, you are glue, and then actually, uh, sorry, and then 
the rest of the rhyme. Hmm. Probably drink whilst it's loading, rather than once it's loaded. But yeah, we're back on the... This is not the promenade. <laughs> Nor is it the uh, graveyard, I hasten to add. I was wrong about that as well. No, I'm dodging and you're not letting me. Have this. Oh, I'm so sick of you. At least that's quick. If you miss the first time, you do get a second chance. Get out of here. Um, but it seems like actually, now I think about it, there's a lot of stuff I've just been wrong about for a long time. Nice. Um, like uh, I don't know if I've been necessarily wrong about it. There's a lot of the these ones where your um your particular why didn't you roll a tiny little bit? What is happening? Have this. Uh, excuse me, I'm just gonna be shit at this game. Um, your particular upbringing may give you an idea of what certain words mean that don't necessarily correspond with what everybody else thinks your certain words mean. Um, and it can cause a little bit of issue because I don't know if maybe I wasn't paying enough attention growing up or if I've been making a lot of choice uh, assumptions, I suppose. Right? Uh, about um, just the way words work. I found that words are a lot more woolen than people tend to assume that they are or give them credit for. Um, so it was just to say there's more flexibility in language than the strict meaning of words, even when those words have multiple meanings. The, the actual no, meaning that the word can convey has, I guess, nuance, right? Um, uh, there's poetry behind it, which is kind of how poetry works. You know, people say words that mean a thing that is similar to the thing that they're trying to say, but in a metaphorical sense. And I guess that's the thing. I tend to, maybe I talk in metaphor a lot more than I think I do. Because um, sometimes I have trouble making myself understood. And the people for whom, with whom I have trouble making myself understood may be considered to be people on the autistic spectrum or something, some other thing where um, the idea of actual um, metaphor is not clear to them. That was very silly. That could have hurt a lot. I'm not even going to waste my time with that one. I wish the um, door counted as an enemy for when I stabbed that one so I could crit them. Uh, yeah, so, so well, that word doesn't mean that thing. It, for example, a good example, which doesn't really infect anybody. Infect anybody? It doesn't really, uh, not a big deal. But, um, different items of clothing have never really mattered to me what they're called. And I'm pretty sure it's, a lot of this is my parents. And I don't mind that. Um, <laughs> I'm not saying, hey, why did you teach me this? Inventory bow plus. No. Um, but corpse, arrows, the prison's archers were really useless. Oh, the hissing stopped. Does that mean you could hear it too? I don't know. Uh, I'm not saying, hey, mum and dad, you suck. Why did you teach me all these wrong words? But they like, maybe their, not I don't want to say grasp of language, but you know, their um, the meanings that they put into words were really not as clear cut. I mean, maybe they didn't mind so much if they said the wrong thing or whatever. Like, it should be knowable from the context what. Like, if a particular word is meant and this is the wrong way of saying it, then surely context can fill in the gaps, right? And I agree. I tend to agree. And I use a lot of context when I talk. That might just be something that I learned from my parents. But other people don't necessarily pick up on it. And I don't know if they should have to. Oh, well, we've been here before. Um, uh, do I... Should I be being more careful with my words, or does it matter that this is not a jumper, it's a sweatshirt, right? These are the questions I have to ask myself reasonably often, because... Yeah, those parries don't count. I'm pretty sure it said melee attacks, but... Um... I hope you, you're recognising my... My... Not really, what is happening here? 
I'm gonna watch you. Uh... Very noisy, but quite funny. Uh, I'm gonna say no, maybe to this. It's all thank you. There's one hit, and I'm doing pretty badly already, so I don't need your help uh, killing me <laughs> on these new runs, which are scary and difficult. Um, I, 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 the, that is the example that I was going to bring up. Like, is this uh, this thing that you wear with a suit, which is not necessarily part this suit style outer slash mid coat? Is it really called? A blazer or I mean yes it's called a blazer but does it have to be called a blazer does everybody call it a blazer does it matter that it's called a blazer or can I get away with calling it as I have done my entire life a jacket Ooh. right these, these are important questions because I'm I don't no one else has ever had a problem with me calling my blazer a jacket. Uh, I've never really bothered with, doing the dif with the differences between jumpers and sweatshirts and hoodies and, and blah blah blah, right? To me it's all about their purpose. It's a jumper if you put it on over the top of some of your clothes. As many clothes as it's comfortable to put it over the top of. And it keeps you warmer than it would have if you didn't wear it. Yeah? Which uh, admittedly puts several... Um, I don't want either of these. Uh... 390, 450, which puts several of these things in a sort of a grey area, for sure. Um, E.g. and for example, some of my clothes could be any of those things, but I, I don't care. <laughs> I, uh, it's, uh, there's a, a long sleeve t-shirt that I have, which isn't really a t-shirt as a result, but uh, who cares, right? Um, which could be construed as a... Uh, jumper because I could put it over the top of a short sleeve t-shirt or it could be construed as a straight up t-shirt because I can wear it directly on with my skin oh genuinely didn't realize why are you not dead where is this leave me alone why what's happening Thank you for appearing just in time to make that person's life a misery. Not both your lives are misery. That was a horrible situation. Because I was trying to use my powerful grenade when their shield was away. But <laughs> shield didn't go away for long enough. There we go. Um, it's, it's these woolly edges of language, and I appreciate I, it's not incorrect. The... The factual part of it is not incorrect. This is a blazer, not a jacket, but who cares? I'm wearing it on the outside. Technically, my coat is an overcoat, but who cares? No one's saying that. And that's kind of my point altogether, is that language evolves, and I've never had a problem with it. Uh, but anyway, this all started off because I was going on about uh, things in Monkey Island and that. I tried to dodge everything. This is too much. Leave me alone. Right, you, you, you can do it. It's going to be easier when I have a couple more um, mutations with my shield going on, but... Kind of upset. Not upset, but it's made it a little bit more difficult because the... Um, why? <laughs> the, uh, the very first reward room didn't really give us as much as I thought we might have been able to... Buy something. I want anything. <laughs> okay. Thank you, I guess. Um, not understanding other people's language meant that I had to sort of infer, essentially from context, what these uh, taunts meant, right? I am rubber, you are glue. I never had the finishing piece bounce off me and stick to you when I first encountered Monkey Island. So I, why do you never get injured, by the way? Like... Like, stunned. Why is this weapon so bad? Is this the weapon that I chose? <laughs> Are you sure? Have it, you. I can't... I can't speak because it's too difficult. <laughs> so, concentrating so hard and still getting it wrong. Frustrating. Quite honest, a little bit frustrating. 
go. You have got stuff. Also, don't die. You picked up a blueprint. You know, there's stuff to do now. Scroll of power. Perfect. Give me this. Also, start parrying more things. Like that. There we go. Okay, everything. Just something. There we go. I don't like this shield. It's not really my favourite. The, uh, the actual weapon itself is only just on the verge of being useful as well because of the ever so slightly too much lead up time, which is an issue sometimes, specifically this time. I'm wondering if there's anything new over here. It doesn't look like it. So uh, thank you for putting me on the promenade, but that wasn't a promenade. Very rude. What is that? There's a doorway and I have not been through it. Let's go and find out. Um. Yeah, all this stuff learning from context and such, which is, I guess that's why I don't consider contextual words to be an issue. It's just a shop. It's just a lame shop with lame things in it. Heck you. You know what? How much does this cost? 2800 Fine. Give me some better things. Alpha grenade, four. Three plus is a four, a five, but four plus is a six. That's a plus plus and gives me green. So I'm actually going to replace the one I've got. Which may not have been the shrewdest of moves, but we will reroll to see if there's anything else good. No, okay. I'm not going to reroll any further because we would like our money to maybe upgrade something. Uh, like the thing that we just got on the premise that we can upgrade it. Yeah, I find I'm always talking contextually. Uh, I think a lot of the time is, and you've heard it, whilst I'm talking, I forget words. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and some words don't really seem to be that important for me to remember, and some words are so good that if I try to remember them, I forget them. Mm. That is the correct time to take a drink, but of course, it took too long. Knife dance. Once there's a storm of knives around you, causing bleeding. I might at some point start doing uh, uh, not survival runs maybe we should take off a boss cell and try other builds or maybe i'll do that off camera what do you think about that is that all right um i don't want to make any progress off camera but i think if i find a, a blueprint in normal mode and bring it back to the collector you'll be all right with that right that's not a big deal burning target so we have all these things that give more damage to a something in target. We don't have anything that causes that thing. And also, I still can't replace this rubbish war spear, which I hate. Let's go down here and find something that is uh, of more value. I think this one is going to be of the next value because, oh, that's rude. You've changed, game. I guess if we went to the sewers, we would get a slightly different um, progression. But uh, I don't know if I'm a fan of this. I can see you. Yeah, I thought you might be mad. Makes me sad. But don't. Roll. Woohoo! Nearly got you. Nearly got me. It's gonna be harder than maybe it should be. This is not the prison depth, is it? it maybe it is actually. You get parried. Sun. Iron cells key, that's new. <laughs> Everything's different. Oh, heck. It says prison depths up there, so there you go. Why? I was not... Because the whole point of me doing that was that this wasn't an option. Thank you for being the two of you. I, I, you see, I was ducking. How are you doing this much damage to me? 30-minute <laughs> episode. All right. Diddly squat, call it done. Thanks for watching. In the next episode, we're going to waffle on a little bit more about contextual words and stuff like that. I keep watching stuff that is interesting and not even talking about it. We'll talk about that in the next episode. Let's see what we're going to play with. Uh, please be decent. Oh, maybe. Oh, I like this one. Okay, sure. Uh, I've done it in the wrong order again. We're happy with this. Come back in the next episode to hear what I have to say about nothing important. And then, thanks for watching this one. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope I will see you then. But until then, thanks for watching. Again, look, have a better sign off. This is this is awkward. Everyone hates it. Just leave.